Hi right, guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Marcus. You're watching Nama Chansa Vlogs. Nama Chansa stands for give me a chance. And then you have vlogs at the end because um it's a video log. Anyway, we're getting today started here at my grandma's pad. We already got a lot of work, uh, work done. I'm going to go through a, um, a lot of the stuff that we went through on the cars. So BMW, um, we are going to pull out the turbos. I don't know exactly when, but um we're going to do it. I was supposed to do it today. Ran out of time right now. I'm going to go pick up the kiddos from school and uh, go hang out with them. Um, SI is, uh, I purchased a couple of things for it, just some um, little, little small things for it, just so um, I can have some content for you guys, um, show you guys what we're going to start doing to the car, just like little by little, because um, the expensive parts are still to come. Um, we want to get coilovers for it because the suspension is shit, so um, stay tuned for which coilovers I'm going to choose for this car. It could be tan, it could be uh, skunk 2, it could be um, function and form, it could be K-tuned. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think I am going to go with. Um, Black Friday is coming up soon at the end of this month. Today is the 1560. I don't know what what day we are on, but um my birthday is at the end of the month too. So um if you guys want to subscribe to the channel just because it's gonna be my birthday soon, Dale Gas. Um hit the subscribe button. We got a little I put a little um watermark. I made a new watermark. I don't know if you guys like it. It's my hatch in the background with the sun. Sky is the limit, guys. Let's get it. So um yeah, little things, little, little things coming from the for the SI. Black Friday, I will be getting coilovers for it, so stay tuned for that video. Uh, hatch, we are, we worked on the hatch for a little bit, um, put everything back together on this other side. Um, we're going to roll the clip right now for you guys of what we did to it. We have a leak in this proportioning valve back here. I am going to re remove the lines and put some uh, plumber's tape, some uh, thread tape on there, th some thread sealing tape, and... Um, yeah, to do that, I gotta pull out all the fluid that's in the brake master cylinder. All right, guys. So most of the fluid is out. We're gonna start clipping all these right here. There's one. Throw that out. There's two. Throw that out. All right, so that's gonna give us or allow us some space. That loosen it up. Okay, so that loosens up the stuff right there. And as you guys can see, there's already brake fluid coming out. Let me get this completely removed. Okay, so we're done right there. We got that line off. We'll let this sit for a little bit. So you guys can see there, there's no thread sealant on there at all. So that's what we're doing here. We're taking these off and we're gonna put some on there so they don't leak any for any longer. Okay guys, that's what our fitting looks like. Make sure everything is dried up. This is a uh, thread sealing tape here, guys. So I got this at Walmart. I don't know how well this, this one works here, this brand. They should all work the same. This thing is like so hard to use cause it's like super, super thin. You just go around, make sure it's like completely straight. This thing is like so flexible, guys. So like one round, you guys will be fine. Right there, you guys can kind of see how the tape goes into the threads. So that's what we want. It gets into the uh, threads there and it allows you to screw it back into the um, original place and um, with the tape on there. So that way it gets like a better snugger um, like a connection. And with the fittings, you will get leaks a lot. So um, it is um, suggested that you use the, the plumber's tape. So we're done with all the uh, Sealing of the threads. So guys, um, got back from the store. Got some uh, Prestone brake fluid dot three dot four. So um, we got the SI right here. We're working on another video, so uh, stay tuned for the next video, which will be on that. We are done with the hatch. <clears throat> we got the brakes done, and uh, now all we got to do is fill her up with some brake fluid, breathe the brake lines, and we should be good to um, drive the hatch again. Also, did pick up some gas for it. I got this container at Harbor Freight, five gallon right here. We'll top it off, but um that little itty bitty um, fitting with the uh, with the tape or that itty bitty like bit of tape is gonna help us stop leaking and it's gonna help us from or keep us from endangering other people ourselves and um, causing any damage to um, my baby or to anybody else's babies like real babies their cars um, yeah I don't want to be a reckless driver especially endangering people with something like that so dangerous as the brakes so um Oh, I'm glad I caught it before anything bad happened. We're good with it now. All I gotta do is break the lines. I mean, break the lines, bleed the brake lines. <laughs> and we should be gravy, baby. So without further ado, guys, let's wrap it up. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.